This is it. Check it out. It's the new foldable electric foldable XP. Cruiser. You're going to get it, man. It's got a throttle right here on the side. It's got power assist just like the bigger bikes. And it's got the big, meaty tires. Look yes, indeed, tires. it does. That is bad, man. Talk about getting some push and brake. And you can actually fold this in half. Folds right in half with that latch you see right here. Drop that baby right in half. You can put two in the back of your Prius for your small car and rock and roll. You got a basket for Toto for the front, Toto basket. You got a solid case here for 60 pounds kickstand. And soon we'll have yeah. the, the alternate big basket you, for the back you, as well. And you got the fat ass ass seat with shock built right into there. Yeah, that's one of the upgrades, but available right now. now. I'm gonna take it for a spin right now and I'm gonna give you a quick report on how this product goes. All right. You ready? Sounds good. Yeah. Right now, it's just going to go. How do you get it to power by itself? Just put it in one mode one and just pull on the throttle. Is it on mode one? You know, you're in pass zero, so you're pedal only. So go plus to one or higher up to five. But if you go to five, it'd be too much. One will give you all you need for getting started. And there goes Tom. I trust he'll be okay because he's been riding bigger bikes for quite some time. You know what I noticed on this? The power assist rocks. Because as you pedal it goes, yeah. you got front end shocks, you got a throttle for speed here, but as say you, you want to hit your brake, it bypasses the juice going to the switch here or going to the pedal. So sometimes when you give it a push and you want to go and it takes off with a certain surge, this prevents it when your fingers on one of the brakes. Yeah, I thought it was pretty. This is just as dialed in as the $3,700 bikes that we got already. And this sucker runs under $1,200 with everything. Well, thank you very much, Tom.